Hello, everyone. Today, the city council appointed Councillor Parada as deputy mayor until the upcoming elections. Councillor Vorthu expressed his displeasure after the session. He opposed the bulk of Mayor Nightingale's policies. A new title won't change that. The deputy mayor responded. This is a trying time for us all. My goal is to keep the lights on until we elect a new mayor. No more, no less. More on this story as it develops. This is Celio Dash with Channel 37. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Now, we've got a whole bunch of stuff happening here. Assembly. Complete. Android personnel. Grants one Android tactical unit. Android units purchasable in supply unlocks all entry level assembly projects. Okay. So we've got modular weapons and modular armor. That reminds me of the previous XCOM games. Now modular androids. Ha. Huh. Now I don't know how useful androids are going to be, so I'm going to leave that for the time being. Now do we go for armor or weapons? Our stock equipment from XCOM is serviceable, but for the threats we face, we'll need to make some modifications. That's what I'm looking forward to. New supply item, auto loader, stock, expanded magazine. Okay, so after this, we'll be able to equip weapon mods. And I'm guessing it's the same for modular armor. Agents can equip armor mods. Infiltrator weave, extra padding, and Mac weave. Kevlar only gets us so far. We can't secure City 31 if we can't last through a tactical encounter. Well, we are in expert mode, so we should probably... I mean, part of the point here is that if we have better weapons and you can kill them, we don't have to take a hit to start off with. Sometimes the best defense is a good offense. But the weapon... Yeah, because we've got autoloader, stock, and expanded magazines. Could they save our lives? There is also the point that no matter what happens, we will have to take some hits at some point. It's only going to take one day. So we don't have to fuss about it too much. Cost 25 electricity. Oh, Illyrium. Okay. So we've got 55 Illyrium there. So we can do both of those. We can do both of those. The question is... It's really just a question for one turn. Let's go armor. Let's play it a little bit on the safer side. Um, okay. And let's go in I'm here. I'm authorizing Chimera Squad for special operations. Some ops provide useful resources for the squad. Keep an eye out for these opportunities. Right, Spec Ops are solo agent duties that help Chimera Squad and City 31 overall. They can improve unrest, gain resources, or reward temporary advantages on missions. Okay. Glad handling. Convince well to do individuals and business groups to advise stopgap to provide for stopgap funding in this time of crisis. It takes three turns and we will get 85 credits. Leg work. Embed with 31 PD for a short time. In return, gain officers to canvas neighborhoods on our behalf. So we would get 65 intel. That would take three turns as well. And finally, we have Illyrium Sting. Set up false buys to draw out underground Illyrium traffickers. Same time, but we'd get Illyrium. So credits, intel, or Illyrium. We'll come back to that because I would need to see if I can hire somebody else. Can I hire another agent? It would seem not. Supply. A sweet deal on combat grade androids. I know. Everyone hates them. Androids serve as reinforcement units if an agent is downed in combat. Okay. Construct a brand new combat grade android. Androids are fully capable tactical units that provide critical backup to agents on combat missions. That sounds like it could be useful. Huh. It's 150 credits though. That's what makes it a sticky one. Oh wait, new android. What does that mean? 
Oh, we got one. You have constructed an android unit. These versatile soldiers are valuable backups to your main squad agents. On any mission where one of your agents is evacuated, an android can take their place for the remaining encounters. So when they say encounter, do they mean each breach area? Maybe. Except tint armor. Let's go for that brick right here. It looks a bit rusty. I like that. No, 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 no. Yeah, it's got a little bit of a rust like feel. Yeah, I like it. Let's stick with that. Upgrade. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> uh, loadout. Fine. Oh, can I choose something else? Ooh, submachine gun or shotgun. Let's stick with assault rifle, body armor, breach item, utility item. Okay. So my general attitude is to go as far as possible without making any commitments until we run into trouble and then or we really know what we really want. Um, no point in second guessing or trying to guess. There are a variety of kinds of mission targets. Investigation. These appear purple, whether a groundwork, operation, or takedown, and will advance the game's story. Side. These appear yellow. They are optional, but provide valuable rewards. Emergency. These appear red, showing up in district with districts with unrest problems. City 31 became the world's only source of androids after retooling Advent Mech Factories. Sacred Coil has been sniffing around there for the past week. Find out why. Yes. So we've got two side missions and two main missions. Hidden faction target five days. Stop android raid. So I wonder if that is a timer on that, the five days. XCOM most wanted. So for this we would get some Illyrium. And this, I'm not sure. Switchyard, okay. What I really want to do though is send somebody off on Spec Ops. If I take, if I pop Torque on that, oh, I should pick one, shouldn't I? Convince, so do I want credits, Intel, or Illyrium? Feels like Illyrium might become very valuable very quickly, but so does credits. I haven't seen the use for Intel yet, so I might hold off on that. I'll go for credits. I don't act, I'm not actually sure, but I want to try it out. Okay, let's try something else first. Let's just go in there and, oh, I have to select a unit, okay. Truth be told, I want to pop Torque into the team, but who would I, okay. Uh, except I'm going to take some chances here and I'm going to put Torque on there because I want to see what Torque is like. So that's going to take one turn to complete anyway, so even without an agent in there. So if it's one, it doesn't reduce any less than that. Now I'm guessing, oh no, that's, oh no, they're both two now. Ha! Huh. So it just didn't update here. I want another squad member, which means that what I'm going to do is this agent is currently sent to Spec Ops duty. You will lose all progress and receive no refund. I didn't pay anything. Are you sure? Yes. Because Spec Ops can wait until we have one more agent. Yeah. I want to see what torque is like for now. And okay, so let's go away. Let's do XCOM's most wanted or Surge. I don't know. Fringe, the fringe. Let's do Governor that one. Squad. I'm Commissioner Maloof of 31 PD. To be blunt, I don't give a chrysalis ass about the politics. I'm glad you're in the city. 31 PD was stretched thin before the mayor's death. There are gaps to fill, and that's where you come in. When your agents can handle a situation better than my officers, I'll send the details your way. 
<laughs> if the city council has a problem with that, I'll take the heat. They can't afford to fire me. I look forward to working with you. I look forward to working with you. Unknown hostiles have deliberately overloaded a power pylon. Destroy it before it shorts out the entire district. All right. Hostile forces may attempt to guard a mission critical device that needs to be stopped. Destroy the device in question when authorized. Keep your distance if you can. All right, boss. So they've all got full health. Thunder. Who's Wait, was her name Thunder? Assault rifle is good. Uh, wait, Thunder is a droid. One, two, three, four, five. So I can have five? I did not know that. Oh, no, that's a reinforcement. Okay. Oh, I see. Okay, I'm understanding that a bit better. Torque. Okay. Let's go. Target device on site. Light it up. All right. Oof. This is not good. I'm going to have to pop somebody into all of these and they're going to take a good amount of damage. Successful shots on enemies during breach will stun. Successful shots. Uh, successful shots on enemies will crit. All units entering here get a plus 25 defense for one round. Plus 50 dodge. Alright, dodge for Cherub. Because he's melee. Defense. Let's give that to... Godmother with her uh, with her shotgun will crit. Let's give that to Verge and Torque. It's appropriate to stun. Let's go. Now. Stay behind me. The hmm. glass shatter is a bit early, isn't it? Ooh, turret. Bruiser. Looks like a muton. Commando. Don't like it. Don't like it. Oof. We are surrounded. Alright. They're gonna have to. Hope for the best here. Uh, Alright. Let's. Let's see aggressive they're all a bit on the aggressive side huh but we don't have very many choices all right Ooh, yeah that was the crit guy okay 87 percent 72 percent that's impressive that we have 87 percent there let's go for it Ooh, only three damage not great. 82%. Let's go. Don't really want to see what the bruiser is good at doing. Oof. Oof. Ah! That was not good. That was not good at all. There's our target. Break it apart. Was this like a super difficult mission that I wasn't paying attention to. Torque can bind adjacent enemies, dealing low damage and making them unable to act on their turn. On Torque's next turn, they have the choice to sustain or release the bind. Tongue pull, subdue, overwatch, bind. So, but for that, I need to be next to them. All right, okay, so that is a civilian. That. All right, who's going to be next? Commando, he's going to be next. What are my chances? 66%. I could pull them in and then suffocate them, which happens fairly often. Tongue wrap. I don't know if I'll be able to do it in this one. Tongue pull. Pull them into melee range. Can be used on enemies and allies. 
All right, let's try it. All right. <laughs> I remember that. That was so cool to be able to do it ourselves. All right, found. Good stuff. We are next. And we're going to see what we can do with this android. 82%. Can we crit? Probably not. Not sure what other choices we will have here. What else can we do? Subdue. That won't do enough damage. Stupor. Can't do anything to the android. So the only choice I have is to either defend... What the hell? Oh... That would have been cool, except... Torque is in the damage range and we won't be able to fully destroy it in one shot anyway. 82% and even if we crit we'd only get one extra damage from the looks of that flashing. Let's go for it anyway. Ooh, we did crit. We got some nice damage. Ooh! Not good. Not at all good. All right, this guy, he's a hitman. We probably want to take that one out. Okay, first things first, let's get into cover because, yeah because I don't want to be shot at by the guy up top. Now let's go for that. See if we can take it out before it self-destructs. Oof. Not good. Not good at all. I guess this is where the expert mode difficulty is coming in. And I should have paid attention. Yeah, I can't do anything about that hitman very easily. Or can I? Dashing. Ooh, okay. If I do that, I can take that guy out. Cannot take that one out. No matter what I do. So, let's take that commando out. I made the arrest. Okay. Disabling target weapon. Oof, bleeding out. <laughs> Cadet Torque is still bleeding out. Okay, so. Oh, shit. I just realized. Oh, enemy reinforcement will soon enter the encounter. After entering, the new enemies will be added to the timeline. Enemy reinforcements? Oh, wait. I can do a stabilize here. Okay. Let's stabilize. Because that's important. Okay, so we've got two people turn after turn. So... That's the one that we want to try and take out. Ooh, wait. What does two do? Uh, what is that one? Stupor. That would disable them for two turns. Battle mat. Let's stupor them. My mind over yours. Well, that's good. Now. Hitman. One. 68%. 68%. Now, if I wanted to... Uh, where can I get into some cover? And... 
right because that guy is on overwatch so if I go up there I'm gonna get shot at where uh, it's impossible to get a height advantage that guy has a good height advantage hmm, it would have been good to get him into some kind of a stupor grenades would have been great no, that's not gonna work. One. All right. Missed. Wait, he was stunned. Verge. No, who is Cherub? Okay. Kinetic shield. Now that's protection. Good. And let's fifty-three fifty-one. Target weapon inside. Not good. So this is definitely getting to be a difficult, very difficult mission. Went from easy to very difficult in like the blink of an eye. All right. What are we going to do? Actually, I do have a plan. I want to disable them because I don't like... Your thoughts are mine. That guy. And then I need to get somebody up there to take him out. As for you, I need to get you behind some cover. Uh, that may not be very safe since there are enemies over here. Let's get you behind. That doesn't work for some reason. Let's get you behind there. Repositioning. Keep to cover. And now what I want to do with Godmother is essentially a run and gun. I want to get her up there. Cover me. Hostiles are aware. Yeah, but hostiles can't do anything. And then I want to take. Okay. Oof, self destruct. Okay. Oof. Thank you for that shield. Oof. The use of that shield has given us some charge. That's great. Stay oh, with us. Bollocks. Darn it. No ammo. That is not great. Chair up. Okay. <sighs> okay. What else are we going to do? We're going to get you there. Heading over there. And. I can't oh wait I need to reload okay let's reload back at it oof again not great one seventy four percent we've got to take them out Godmother is still bleeding out. Not good. Can we finish this mission? I don't know. Seriously, you just walked right there? Okay. Wait. What? 
are you doing? Oops. Okay. Okay, so the one there is gone. Okay. I want to stabilize. What happens if I don't stabilize? The mission is... But what I am curious about is how come we didn't get a, the droid coming in as as backup? I will check that out momentarily. For now, let's prevent them from bleeding out. Ah, we might not make it. It was not a fatal blow. Good. <laughs> All right, we only have one guy left. Wait, what's what's happening? Okay. Let us see if we can do anything here. Okay, one down. We've got two more to go. Oof! All right. Uh, a reclamation agent has died. XCOM cannot endure agent casualties in this fight. So let us restart the mission. Target device on site. Light it up. All right, so stun. Let's have, who is good at, who do I want doing a stun? Um, torque can stun. And for a crit, Godmother. Uh, defense for one round. Who do we have? And a dodge. Okay, let's go. Move in now. Right, so I don't think a turret can be stunned, so let's forget that one. Let's hit the bruiser so that they are stunned. Doesn't say if they are stunned. Let's take the turret out. It has one health left. Ah, that's annoying. Bruiser stunned. 62%. Let's do it. Missed. Oh, missed. Good. Three hit there is not good. Missed. Good. Oh. That worked out a bit better for us RNG wise. We're here for that target. Smash it to pieces. Oh, I see. So our aim here is to. How come I didn't pay attention to that? So our job is to destroy this. All right. Commando. We also need to clear the cube farm. Oh, destroy the pylon to stop reinforcements. Okay. I should have been paying more attention last time. Okay, commando. Android. Okay. What I miss, you know, grenades. Ah, it was just a graze. Okay. Right, those guys are shrouded. That's fine. That's okay too. What I want is... What? What I want is to do... Ooh, if I do that, I might lose that civilian. Yeah, that's... Uh, I might lose that civilian anyway. Uh, 
Why'd you run in there, Sivvy? Right. I just want to check something here. Yeah, it's definitely gonna... It's got a lot more health. It's fine. Oof. It's a real gamble to do that. Okay, so let's just check. Okay, it's that guy who's going to attack us next. But this one has primed the self-destruct. Ah, alright, let's do it. Still standing. Closing on target. Engaging. Right, I have some ideas. Right, what I want to do is not... I want to... I don't want to give this guy battle madness. I want to... Stupor him. Yeah. My mind over yours. Now... Now what I want to do... Is I can't get up there. I do, however, want to figure out, okay, that guy is next. There is that guy. Is, ooh, okay, so I have an idea. Can I? If I get there, no, that guy's... Oh, man, I will have to get all the way on that side to be able to clear him. I'm going to do that anyway. That thing is ready to explode. Weapon in play. Hold on, hold on. That guy is stunned. How come he's attacking? That does not make any sense. For so that doesn't wait until the end of the round. <sighs> I'm gonna have to figure out another strategy here. Right. Okay. Kinetic shield for yourself, please. Now that's protection. And can I do a charged bash? Yes, please. It's kind of exactly what I want. Let me try again. Okay, so we've got plus one charge. Stay with us. What? Alright. What is the chunk? 50%. 36%. Who is bleeding out? Okay. So. Let's do that. Aha! Uh -huh. Three. Question is, should I grab this dude down? Why didn't I think of that before? Wait, who is going to get their turn? So that commando is going to go next, then trooper, then the hitman. Okay, I'm going to do that. Not cherub. I'm going to bring the hitman right you, there. Come here. Can I do anything else? I don't want to bind them. Can I end my turn? Um, camera rotate, pause menu, and turn. Covering okay. the distance. Ah, sorry, Cherub. Right. I know I can take you out, but first. <sighs> 
That still has... Okay. I'm gonna take it. Okay, finally. I took the hitman out. That's progress. Right. Now, we have three people to take out. Wait. One, two, three of us to take out one, two, three of them. Right. I can't take them out. Okay. And that's only good. that's going to do even less damage. Kinetic shield. Who needs it most? Godmother. Yes. And now I am going to move. Ah, you think I, you think Torque could move the civilian out of the way? Uh, I have, okay, who are the enemies? We've got, oh, one is hiding behind there and one is there. And we've got that trooper. Okay, I'm gonna ignore that trooper for the time being. I'm going to team up with Godmother. Okay, team up. Okay, and then forty six per cent, forty three. Oof. Ah, I'd lose a civilian. 46, let's try it. Missed. Okay. I'm running low. Okay, because I can't take a hit. Good. Subdue. Let's do a subdue. I can take that guy out. Let's take this guy out. Arrested the target. Good. Oh, that guy ran away. Because my plan was to detonate this thing when that guy was still there. 41, 41. Yes, thank you, kinetic shield. So, okay, we've got two charges now. All right, Cherub, I hope you're ready. Because we are... That's the only one. If I go for a one... 59% doesn't count. Okay, let's go. Nice. Book them. All right, so it's three against one now, which is exactly how I like to play this game. Hmm, you know, I would have liked to trade places. Can I, so if I do preparation, increase, take next turn earlier on the timeline. Uh, so how is it now? So if I use preparation, I don't know what that means. Earlier, but that's exactly where I would be. One, two, three, four, five. Huh. What I really wanted is to be after torque. Which is fine. Let's get over here. 
which is the nearest I can get that is safe. Nearest I can get to that guy that is safe. Let's take a shot. Missed. That's fine. Because I believe I can do this. Shame you didn't resist. Oof. From three captured enemies, there's a 60% chance to 120 intel. Oof, those pylons kept the lights on before City 31 had reliable hydroelectric. Now they're a target for bad actors. So Godmother is wounded, Cherub is lightly wounded, Verge is gravely wounded because he was... Uh, but I am unsure as to why Thunder was undeployed. I thought that when Verge went down, Thunder would get deployed. I will need to read up on that. Oh, I see. So we got 35 Illyrium and 20 Intel. Advent used to house us in the fringes, cramped old world buildings. Then the war ended. Advent went to detention camps and everyone in the fringe moved to Advent's now vacated Highland Square homes. So where did all the former Advent go to when the camps let them out? You guessed it. The same buildings they forced us to live in during the occupation. Huh. Assembly complete. Modular armor. So, I'll need to keep an eye on unrest. Whoa. The city is shaken by the untimely loss of our mayor. But with everything this city has been through, I have to believe we'll come out of this stronger than ever. Let's not sugarcoat this, Roger. How can we feel safe when our duly elected officials are kidnapped and assassinated? You're absolutely right. This is a tragedy. We can't forget or forgive. But how do we move on? Tension can be felt on every street and in every home. Together, Glorgo, that's how we move on. Throughout our city's history, we've faced many challenges and threats, but only together can we find peace. Let's hope you're right. Well, that was an exciting mission. Really challenged us a little bit. Uh, and I had to try it a couple of times to actually get the win. Uh, we have lots of things to explore. Assembly, training, we've got Anarchy and Unrest Change, which we'll figure out. Trainer Online, this is the training area to view available programs. We've got promotions and we've got a scar. And we've got new supply items. All of that and more. <laughs> Sound like an advertisement now. In the next episode. Stay tuned. <laughs> Sorry. Um, but yeah. In the next episode, thank you so very much for joining me, and I'll see you again next time.